Hey there everyone, this is Alcal playing VLDCX and today we're going to be starting with Unforeseen Consequences by Chihaya or Guia. Not sure how to pronounce your names, I'm very sorry about that. Here we go! All the yeses, all the noes! So Unforeseen Consequences are on the real map. <laughs> I like the name here. <laughs> Consequence. <laughs> Good start. Alright, we're in Green Cave. We got Donkey Kong Country music. The third one though. Yeah, it's the the sewage music, the pipe music. Alright, okay, so last time, yesterday, I've started to get the vibe that we're going into the nice and safe sort of station of the country of the contest. I'm ooh, the music here just kinda had an indigestion. <laughs> It happens. <laughs> so, yeah, so that's just kind of the vibe I'm getting for these placement. I guess we'll see, you know? God, the, these boxes, like, they don't care about poison. Why would they care? They're boxes. Like, they're, they're already dead uh, tree pieces. Uh, wow, yeah, I did not have the right reflex for that sequence. Well, it's not really a sequence, that singular... Thing. Uh, this one is kind of interesting a little bit. Oh, here we got, you know, we got noodle spikes. Getting pretty close. Just maybe something up there where there's coins, just kind of chilling. Like in a really risky spot that you have no reasons to visit. Very strange. That skeleton's walking back and forth. Now that's what I call strange. Alright, well, there might be something cool here, like coins and. Oh, okay. So, it's meant to indicate a shortcut, actually. Well, I figured it wasn't just there for no reason. Like, that's more or less why I did point it out. And uh, But I just didn't want to take the chance. Like, to just kind of bop myself into pieces for no reason. And I'm glad I did. Alright, so here we're replacing poison with spikes. This time, because that means you can put it over the boxes and protect them from raccoons. Uh, if PCA, which is a fictional organization, doesn't like it when you just poison raccoons with radioactive sludge, it turns out. I don't get it, though. I think that would be a lot of fun. Midpoint in the house, that skeleton still be walking. Uh-oh, uh, I'm starting to run out of time. I guess I wasn't supposed to explore and look around. Well, I missed my- messed up my jump there. That was just an excuse to reset my timing, my timer. You know, it was blaring at me, wanted my attention. Strictly speaking, you're further ahead when you get so ideally if you're speed running. Whoa, looking pretty silly there. Skull hand. Looking pretty silly there. Potobo ambush is popping up, no real indication where you're at, so this creates the worst kind of raft ride. I really hate it when, honestly, when this is happening. Because that means, okay, so you gotta pay super close attention. Wait a second, I can't go here. <laughs> Try to land on the skull hand, it didn't work out. Alright, see or unforeseen consequences. I didn't foresee this consequence of something. All right, so where's the potabo? Okay, just hop a ride. Then you want to go here probably. Hi, there you go. And you're like, hey friend, how's it going? You hang out on this hanging wooden structure a lot, cause I would too if I was a sweet skeleton with red shoes. Just Stay on your wooden thing, then we end up going somewhere we don't understand. Alright, well, if you have to put on the light show, there's a platform here, and there's a sign with an arrow there. Jumping to the right of r vines is the worst thing that can happen to me. Alright, so I'm trying to see the land here. Doesn't look to be as unsafe as you might think. I'm glad that the Potabo have their safety colors on in order to, you know, to make sure they don't get ran over something grim like that, you know, while crossing the street. 
See Ninji here, he's barely visible. That's just an accident waiting to happen. I haven't seen any Dagadon yet. Like, I don't know if they're like in their own thing or what, but here's a rezone. Okay. Do you want to resurrect? Oh, hi there, guy. Alright, well, here we're just, you know, we're just doing some bops in the midnight skate park. As you do, round law. Oh, what? Uh. Okay, well, I'm a balloon now. It happens. I'm a little afraid. Because a Potobo can just decide to go like, hey, how you feel about cream soda? And the reality is I just don't have an opin opinion prepared. For a second there, I don't know why, I thought I had a star. I think I got mixed up with just like the coin glitter or something, which is pretty silly. Don't know where I'm going or where I want to go. I get a feeling I might have messed it up, yo. But I can go on top here, I don't know. I found the moon, just watch it glow. Alright, well, the level continues here, so let's go. Yeah, coin number two, that's basically all of them. Yeah, I got the feeling there were side paths and whatnot, especially in the dark. But by virtue of it being in the dark, I'm... I kind of predisposed to not wanting to explore and just kind of beam directly in the most direct way to my end goal. So that's what happened. It's always a risk to make darkness a main thing. You might tell yourself, no, no, I did it. I found out the, the way to make a darkness level work. Ah. Uh... The problem is, it's not just your level. You're fighting against all the impresses I had and all my past experiences and all dark levels that came beforehand. It's an odyssey, a space odyssey by Matthias2653. Uh, yeah, there it goes. His name is right there on the title screen. Well, there you go, man. Space Aussie, gonna throw our hats, everything's included. Who knows what that's mean? I am at the Star World, just in... Okay, we got this music, we got the starry background, we got the moon, kind of. Mossy moon, oh. Don't destroy my heads, collection! Is this like a real key, do you think? That's just kind of put in here? To make it solid, and then if you hold the run button, you pick it up. Yeah, and, and these are blocks. Enemies and object can enter on them to keep straight off the gun. Beepity bop, the boobly bob. Got it. Okay, so yeah, it's this block, your friend and I. We've seen it, we love it. Well, I might be exaggerating. Oh, uh, well, there goes the platform, I guess. Holding a key, I don't know why. Just chop, chopped up in pieces to die. Because I'm holding this key, it's harder to spin the jump. Yes, sir. That guy is real happy to be here, and that is pretty swell. There's more planets everywhere. So it's carrying it for no reason. Feels pretty bad. They there, it's a horse. I don't know what about that. I can't go through the thing, so I don't know what to do. That plant is so confused. Well, that is just great news. Uh, check it out, there's a mushroom thing. I'm going to get my mushroom thing. And then bounce out and look at that Boomba. He's stuck in glass. What a thing. Okay, there's a ceiling here. So maybe I don't want to bring that in exchange instead. Alright, well let's go. Cut the cheese. Going in circle as you please. And one, oh, maybe you want to go where there's a hole in the middle. I don't know. For Dagnon and almost getting cut in two. Alright, well, there's that obstacle. So, right, if you don't want it to move. Well, this one I don't care if it moves because I don't want. See, I don't have the key with me anymore. Right, no, but the key's right there. So, the Dag coins hide a secret treasure. Collect all the Dagnon and then enter the level again. Uh, that does make me a little bit curious, to be perfectly honest. Hey, look at that. Oh. So, yeah, do it with up so that it doesn't move. You get a very explicit mention about it. Oh, look at that weird pipe. I can just go right through the skeleton morsel. Zoo, just go through the bones and end up at a place you don't understand. That's a death pipe, don't go there. 
death. Yeah, death birds. The birds. And here, it's just a swim. Don't mind him. He's just a happy boy having fun. Oh, that's silly. Okay, there's a cannon. Whoa, it's Charlie. I gotta go through the doom and gloom. The thwomp is gonna fall and then the switch went boom. <laughs> that's pretty funny. <laughs> That has amused me. Hey, Spike Chariot, Flight Chariot, and other things, and I say that don't make sense. Yeah, I want you to, yeah, see? There's a little secret here. If you notice that, there's things, and then the roof here is all like kind of bendy. We know that what this means be. Means be! Here we go, time to buzz. Fly over a circle, and pull highlights. Why is there a skull on that thing? I don't know, like, that to me reads danger, but... I don't know anything. Like, maybe it means something specific, but okay, so... There is a roof above some heads. Here I just fell. Alright, well... Oh, hi. I just killed something. So, am I... Breaking things, or... Hi. <laughs> Sorry, I was just kind of absorbing what was going on here. There we go. Look at that. Yeah, it's like the skull. I don't know what skeleton aspect means, but hey, it's there. You did it. Hey, what's in there? The bush. Uh, can I race my mushroom at least? Can you like... I guess there's just nothing. Okay, well... Follow me, peppercorn! You did it. You peppered that corn. Ah, oh, it's too peppery now. I can't eat it anymore. I have a sensitive palate. Don't know what is going on. Do I need to know, though? I do not know. Death zone, give me a key. Reset our felicity. I'm just gonna ride my key to school. Gonna leave it in my locker and then go drool for eight hours. Oh boy, here we- well, there's a secret exit. Uh, I guess there's just a secret exit? I don't know. So, okay, I got all the dagading dong dongs I got a big bop right there. I'm curious, like, how much did the level change? Because I was threatened with that, and I want to know what it means. Like... Like, what do I have access of that I didn't before? Tell me now, video game. That's not where you tell me about that. Well, now there's a moon there. <laughs> I mean, that's not really what I was expecting. The music's going that, 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 that. That's pretty exciting. Is it just that now there's moons instead? I mean, like, that is a change. I mean, you can't deny that. Just, just, you know, you read about it and you're like, well, that sounds exciting but you don't know what it necessarily is going to mean. Like, maybe it's the key to get... Oh, whoops. Well, you know what? I got an extra moon. I've done it. I, I don't know enough, like, what changes or not, if it's worth it or not. Maybe someone can spice in to use a verb that's not a verb. Anomalous Separatus by Rubber Jig, and we've hit it. Mario's face is red. This is, I believe, the median of the contest. It's the 86th place, but it is also the 86th level that I'm playing. It's Yoshi's house. Whoa, what's that place? It's over there. So there you go, we did it. We hit the middle. Oh man, look at this place. I've been waiting for one for a long time. I thought it gets busy, but never came out. Please come on in. I'm all right. Oh, I'm liking this music. Oh, it's over. All right, well, here's a fireball. Yeah, everything kind of has like a, a color filter to it. So, like, Mario's face being weirdly red uh, makes a lot of sense within the level. Is this a remix? Oh, this is a combination of blocks. Okay. Ah, uh, it's easy enough to deal with. You just kind of have to think about circles. Is there an object behind that thing, or is it just like a post? Okay, well, I could go, what? Fireball spewing fireball. This is the kind of house this is. Spikes on a floor. 
That's also the kind of house that says, okay, can't go underneath here. This is not a real Dagadon, but there's one over there. I mean, all right, I'm gonna humor for now. Timer is kind of high. Hi, laser, how's it going? So yeah, Dagadon, like, retains its shininess. The way that that dull imitation of there clearly does not. Oh, uh, there's a lot of activity going on here, and the roof is shaking. Some point, find a piece which an open up this roof thing. That ghost just made a funny face and I don't I hate it. Alright, here we go. Everything's shaking all the time. Are we like in a basement? I don't know. Look at that. It's just oh, well, well, okay. I I did jump kind of way more earlier than needed than absolutely necessary. It's ghosts in rugs. Well, I feel like at this point, I'm so far away from where the P-Switch would be relevant that I'm probably not gonna return. Uh, oh, this is, a uh... This is something. Okay. This combination of men in this setup? Yeah, no, that was something. So that lamp, that hanging lamp. Do you think it's solid? I don't think so, so I'm... Oh, it was solid! <laughs> Well, it was right at the midpoint, it's fine. So yeah, I was assuming it'd be uh, an act of... Did I not get the midpoint? I did. I'm somewhere completely different now. Oh, I should have read the text then, but I, I, I was just confused. I love what you did with the... Oh, that I can't go on anymore, okay. The music's like this weird reversed version. Oh, I'm loving this. This is really rad. Is it different to see in it? Please come in. No, okay. You are supposed to be confused. We're like, well, my med point dead in med point. Gonna remove five dots to my tablecloth. But then you realize it was all a ruse. Clog is gigantic. It's not, but because of the window frame around it, it makes it look better. Bigger. Maybe not better. Definitely bigger. This is so rad, though. Okay, so... This is, like, a very dangerous... Where- like, no, I... Um... Like, real fast. And then you're like, you're just kind of left here. Alright, well, okay, uh, yeah, upside down big boo. That is pretty silly. So there's probably, like, one big, like, mega puzzle for a secret exit, and I appreciate that, that probably... I keep forgetting. They look like, like, okay, like, I'm, I'm aware that they are darker. So, you, your intent is to make it, you know, us understand that they're a background object because they are a doc, a, a doctor shade, you know, they're doctor shade. But, nonetheless, like, they're the same shape, you know? And I, I guess, visually, I process shape before I process color. Because my immediate instinct is it's one of those wooden ghost house platform. I'm gonna go on this, but I can't go on this. There's there's an egg. It's a ghost egg. It's pretty spooky. Yeah, it's just kind of sitting there too. That's just weirder. Like what's going on with I don't want to mess around with no ghost horse. I don't want to get attacked by a Dulahan or something. They don't like it when you mess with their horses. Probably, I'm just kind of... Alright, so... First half, I just blazed through it. I'm just getting nickel and dimed in the second half there. <laughs> just little things. Like, I knew those platforms would be different. I wasn't sure how. And then I lightly tap a key platform underneath me. See, he I don't like this part. You just kind of get squazzled in. And it's really uncomfortable. And it just seems like weirdly hard compared to everything else. Maybe I'm over exaggerating. But that is my sincere brain thoughts as they're happening. So I don't know what else I can offer. Upside down steamy music though is still such a cool, cool, cool thing. Alright, here we go, here we go. There we go. Hey, remember this guy? Well, this time, I'm going to do that. That's right. Alright, so you kind of want to go in at the last minute so you can do this, this, and there we go. And then it says, go back! 
I'm, no. I'm good. Uh, will something have changed? Well, the platforms respawn, so... Maybe. Alright, so this one's a bit easier. Oh yeah, there's something going on, because now I'm hearing those thwomps. So maybe something has happened. Well, for one thing, that Dagadon is up there now. Like, what's up with that? Okay, I think layer madness happened. Yeah, whoa. Did we reflip around? What do I do with this small child? I don't know. I don't know how this was done. Ah! Oh, God! Fart! I knew it! I knew! Yeah, sure. Fire guy stem. Alright, somehow, touching this wall will now twist the universe around in a cool, unexpected way. And the key is the, like, the, the, the bump bump sound. Like, it's not thwomps. I think it's Slayer too. I hear you give me this guy. I just, like, when do I... When I, when I fill you up, you know? Go big jump, or die jump as it's called somewhere. Oh yeah, just make sure block guy there is not in the way. Whoa, did it. All right, so this is a little bit more doable. Still carrying this blue Yoshi around and I don't know why. All right, well, if I'm gonna get hit, might as well just get in. Yeah, I got this, I got this guy making a funny face and I, okay, well, <laughs> I had a Yoshi with me. Uh, I'm gonna leave him in, I guess. Like, he's part of the decor. Really cool level! Weird in the little instrument and the end jingle there. Like, I'm honestly kind of curious to know how it got where it got. I thought this was really rad. I thought it was really well done. Yeah, some of the jumps are not super comfortable, but I mean, that's fine. Oh. Got a game over though. We weren't supposed to touch the yellow switch palace. Oops!